All right, so we got all the old pylon off. Winnebago uses an interlocking roof system so that uh, there's actually not a lot of framing in this roof. When we get the, the blue one, which is that eighth inch paneling, and we pull it off, I'll show a few pictures, but you won't really see any real support. What there are is right about here, you see those two screws on that tab, and right there on that tab. So there's just a few of those, and it's just a bent piece of sheet metal, like a bow. So there's, that's the only real structure. So the laminate that we're standing on is really <laughs> as much as it is. So we got the first panel off. Take a look at what's underneath that panel. It's just foam. We got the free wire for the satellite right there that's not on there. We got a free wire for a powered vent, which is not being used. So they just CNC out this and put the decking on top. What I did have to clean off is there's this metal plate. That's the structure that actually holds the uh, TV antenna down. So we'll leave that there. I just had to get the, the layer of wood off of it so that when we put the new deck on there there's not a bump there uh i just have to blow this off and then we're gonna we'll put a, a layer of glue here spray a, a coat on the other side of the uh the loo on and put it up here push it in place do the next one do the next one do the next one all that way one at a time contact adhesive pretty much for industrial use or it's not something picking up at home depot put it that way this is actually stay bond they make a uh, fame <coughs> excuse me a foam safe and then a non-foam safe so since we're doing this on foam you need to make sure you're doing a foam safe so you don't melt it done decking this but I didn't get the chance to show you that rib I was telling you about it's right here it goes all the way across and this notch over to there so there's just a handful of those little ribs that is the structure when you have the filing on top and see everything you step on it you'll actually see it buckle a little bit each time Damn it, Chad!
Like a glove. Looks like it works. We're good. Open the hole up. Why didn't you get a man's drill? You know where my man's drill is, Jamie? Oh, you have? No, it's in my toolbox. It's far away. <laughs> So what we're going to do now is trim up the edges and run a chalk line down the middle to find the middle of the motorhome. That'll be it for the day. Wish you had a man drill. Almost. Let me blow that hole. What? We're good. Sure, are good at blowing. <laughs>